morning guys, it's Jabba Robosa here and today I will sh today 1.17 beta is falling out today and I want to try I want to show you my um, first experience with this new Minecraft 1.17. So I'm on the beta version which is uh, 1.17.0.50. Actually there was a problem with the texture pack. Let me show you what I did. So I did not enable any resource packs or behavior packs. It's just already like this in my Minecraft world. I don't know why and what caused these things. But without further ado, let's begin this video. And let's begin the game. 1.17.0.50 adds the amethyst blocks and new item and uh, raw items. <laughs> Java Edition is having most items to Bedrock Edition. Let's see, Java Party. First of all, we have a uh, tough. So this is your tough in here. I can uh, see. So you can now build more houses with newer blocks such as these things. Uh, <laughs> Moving on. Calcite. Yeah. So this is your calcite right here. This looks really amazing. I'm really not gonna lie. And I think this texture looks like diorite, but smoother texture. Mm. And smooth basalt. So it's your smooth basalt. So this is what you this is what you get from uh, smelting basalt in the furnace. I will show everything later. Calcite looks smoother than diorite. So this is your calcite right there, and that's your uh, diorite. They both look different, but due to the texture. Due to the Minecraft Classic Texture Pack enabled already, I don't know why, maybe it's an error with the experimental world. This did not actually match between, because the diorite should have the same, the, should have the new texture update. <laughs> uh, anyway, let's move on. Amethyst blocks added. So there's your amethyst block. So, I know this was first added to Java Edition, all of this in Snapshot 20W45A, except for the smooth basalt and the raw items, which I'll show you later. Next of all, we have Budding, am the budding Amethyst. This is not obtainable in survival mode, even with Diamond Pickaxe Silk Touch. But, do you know where you can obtain Budding Amethyst? You can only get it with forward slash give command. Oops, give command and also on the creative inventory. Like, here's your budding amethyst. Wait a sec. Did you notice that there was an um, amethyst uh, growing in my budding amethyst? Maybe most of you will know this. Amethyst clusters. Yeah, here's your amethyst cluster. You cannot only place this on budding amethyst. But you can place it anywhere, like on grass block, as, you, I, as I showed you. See, you can, you can also place it anywhere. Even the bud versions of it. Not bad anyway. Spyglass! And you can see the glow item frame also has a new texture to match Java Edition. But I don't think it still glows. But here's your spyglass. When you, when you hold right click or when you use LT, as you can see in my controller when I hold this, you can see it zooms into a place. Ooh, what's the strider do? Oh, I can zoom into the strider. You see, I can see the strider care look more. Oh, you can see he's shivering also. I don't know why. Amethyst shards. So there's your amethyst shard. This is where you will craft the next one, which I will show you later. And that's tinted glass. So it's just tinted glass in here. Sure, tinted glass. So how do you craft tinted glass? You will need a glass. You will need a glass surrounded by by four amethyst char shards in a crafting table. So let me demonstrate it, how it looks like. So this is how you craft tinted glass. Uh, glass with amethyst shards surrounding its place, and there you can get tinted glass. Not bad after all. Raw metals. Yes. Now let's let me show you some of these. We have raw iron, raw gold. 
and also raw copper. Oh, it looks like, looks like an egg, right? <laughs> it's block variations. We got block of raw iron, raw copper, and raw gold. And I think... Oh, wait, there's still more. <laughs> implemented features. This was supposed to be implemented, but this is removed features because they're not anymore in experimental gameplay. Glow Lichen is no longer available behind experimental gameplay. So I was going back on my tutorial world on the tutorial worlds of Legacy Console Edition. They don't have experimental gameplay because some of them are failures. Then we got powder snow here, powder snow buckets, then powder snow it's also implemented. And now my first, my favorite part, it's not implemented yet for experimental gameplay. Glow item frame has changed. So you can see I told you earlier. You can see this glow item frame now has a different texture to match Java Edition. However, when you still pick this block, it's still an item frame. I don't know why this this is still a bug for glow item frames. And another bug I also noticed in Minecraft Bedrock Edition is that you can suffer like this. When you have the mayor shirt, or when I'm in my experimental world, when I move to this block, I can easily suffocate. I don't know why this is was a bug, but Hopefully it may be fixed in the Caves and Clips release. Hopefully. So that's pretty much it for the 1.17.0.50 uh, beta today. So now let me show you how I how let me show you experimenting and testing these things. So we got this stuff in here. You can uh, you can make some. This actually go from splotches, calcite. Also, this is smooth, smooth texture of diorite, diorite, yeah, diorite smooth textures. And this just can be found in an amethyst geode. I created a new world showcasing the 1.17.0.50, but I cannot find any amethyst geodes either. For now, let me experiment something else that you all will know. One of these are uh, the basalt, the smooth basalt. So let me show you how it is smelted. You cannot do this already. In, so you cannot do this in 1.16. They did not add this in 1.16. This is only added in 1.17. This is for 1.17. And there you go. You see your output. We got smooth basalt. You can not only get this in amethyst geodes, but you can also get... It from smelting basalt in a furnace. For this, you can also, I don't think you can bone meal, but in amethyst, let's check it out. No, but I want to hear this new sound for bone meal. That's weird. It should give me a new sound. This is weird. Uh, guys, if you're, maybe if you were playing in the Xbox One, like my platform right now, due to it, be due to it becoming backwards compatible on next gen consoles. Uh, I don't know what happened. Why it's not available for the Xbox console? Why is there's no no there's no bone meal sound yet? I don't think it's still available for Xbox. It's still under development. But as you can see, let's move to another world. So I will show you why that, that powder snow is not anymore in experimental gameplay. Let me show you. So here is Tia31's tutorial world. As you can see here, it is combined with log furniture add-on. I don't know why, but because of this becoming a good tutorial world, I decided to put that also in this tutorial world. And you can bring some of these to, to cure it like that. But that's not why, that's not why I'm here for. I'm here because of the new 1.17. I'm recording it. So as you can see here, there's an ice spikes biome. So as you can see, wait, where's the, oh, there's a glow lichen. You see there? You see glow lichen? There's no experimental gameplay. You see? Then there's also powder snow. You see here? Powder snow. So wow. If you now even, so bedrock players, even if you don't have experimental gameplay, you can, in beta versions, you can now put powder snow to trap your friends in an ice spikes biome. Let me showcase like this one for now. And I have to, uh, this is so amazing. Let me show you a showcase about this. So, sit back and watch.
Sorry, foxes. I'm just making a video. That's why I'm doing this to you. This is also another add-on. There will be a link to those in the description if I can find it again. But as you can see here, you can see this just have the recreation of T12 Tutorial World. Maybe when I have experimental gameplay on, I will transform this title update 12 Tutorial World Lush Cave into a, a really, really awesome Lush Cave. This is a predated Lush Cave from 4G Studios when this Tutorial World was created back in the day. I really miss this tutorial world. So if you get, if you guys did, also please let me know in the comment section below. Well, let's go back to my experiment. Uh, looks like I'm eight percent, but now I have to go. But thank you so much for watching, everyone. I'll see you guys next time.